Holly asked about raisins. She said she's been having raisins as a like dessert after dinner snack. Do, do those have too much sugar? Um, so I happen to know Holly very well, and I know that she um, has great triglycerides. Her weight is great. Uh, she doesn't, uh, her only goal is to be healthy and feel energized. So I would say that if you have a triglyceride problem, if you are pre-diabetic or diabetic, or um, if you're trying actively to lose weight, then raisins probably are not your best bet. But if your only goal is to just feel great, then I'm totally good with some raisins. They do have much more sugar uh, because they're dried, or much more sugar per space, like per cup, um, because they're dried. So they take out the water content. Here's what I mean. A cup of raisins has 98 grams of sugar. A cup of grapes has 15 grams of sugar. So far, far, far less sugar if you actually just eat the grape. Um, and I know raisins are like poppable, munchy, but that's part of the problem. You can easily eat a cup of raisins. 98 grams of sugar though, that's more than three cans of Coke. That's too much sugar, even though it's from um, natural added sugar, if you have any of those. Actually, that's too much sugar anyway, even for Holly, um, even if you feel perfectly healthy already. So if you have none of the conditions that I mentioned before and you're just eating it as a snack, a quarter cup of raisins, a third cup of raisins is good with me. Um, if you have any of those conditions, skip them all together and no one should be eating a whole cup of raisins at one time. So here are a couple alternatives. Frozen grapes are amazing. If you've never tried frozen grapes, it seems like too simple to be great, um, great grape, but they actually are fantastic and they taste sweeter when they're frozen and you can't just like plow through eight cups of frozen grapes because I don't know if you have that like tooth sensitivity or even if you don't, it's kind of hard to just chew through frozen grapes. If you can do that, we should not challenge each other to a frozen grape eating competition because I cannot and I think most people cannot. Um, so frozen grapes are a really good option. Trail mix. So obviously there's raisins in there, which is why I'm suggesting it, but having the added nuts or seeds in there adds the fat, the good healthy fat to help stabilize the blood sugar. Remember I just said we need protein, fat, and or fiber to stabilize the blood sugar when we have sugar. So trail mix would even be better than raisins. Still limit your portions because it's still high in sugar, high in calories. You know I don't count calories or promote counting calories, uh, but you can overdo it.